Welcome back everybody and welcome back to the channel and welcome back for another NASCAR diecast review. Today we're going to be reviewing the, let me see what year it's from, it is from 2003, Robbie Gordon, number 31, singular wireless car. So it's a nice car, just got this the uh, other day through one of my websites that I get NASCAR stuff from. And if I haven't told you guys before, it's called Macari.com. There's a, they have a lot of great stuff on there. A lot of great older NASCAR stuff, all different kinds of drivers, you know, I mean, you name it, there's people on there selling it, but you know, some people are trying to sell it for a lot and some people are selling it for really, really cheap. So if you get on there and you're into the old NASCAR stuff, you know, I mean, it's like, say they got, they even got stuff back from the nineties um all different kind of drivers richard petty rusty wallace um that's just to name a couple i mean they got like jeff bodine all those kind of guys you know just put in their name and all kinds of stuff comes up so we're gonna open this up and get busier and show you what we got So as you can see, singular wireless, number 31. And it's got some really, I want to call it day glow orange colors, which is pretty cool. I don't know if this thing, uh, take a black light to it. I bet you this really, uh, <laughs> it really looks really nice. But yeah, it's a thing I got this for like um, 17 or $18. And but shipping and tax, I think it came up to like 26 bucks, which ain't too bad. So, if I didn't have a Robbie Gordon car, I figured I'd get one. I know he, he raced a bunch of different cars from the uh, Bush series up to the Cup series. Uh, trunk does open up, I'll show you the fuel cylinder. And, of course, these cars don't have no DIN number or anything like that. This is before all that kind of stuff. So, and it's got the nice detail engine in there. doesn't have spark plug wires on it, but it's pretty detailed compared to, you know, nowadays. And then you got the underneath. And you've got sticker tires on them. I don't think there's any of these springs don't come down. The whole all underneath is all die cast as well. Separate engine parts, the engine, exhaust, boom tubes. Oops. Yeah, all of these, all the tires have got, got sticker tires on them. Oh uh, yeah. Got the <clears throat> 31, which it used to race for RCR. And I think the uh, number 31 nowadays, I think that one's, uh, I want to say it's Justin Haley who races that number now. Yeah, but it's a pretty nice car. It wasn't even that dusty or anything when I got it. Sometimes I'll get older cars from uh, sellers and they'll kind of be dusty a little bit from sitting on their shelves or something like that. But this one, I mean, when I opened up, it looked like it was, it was never on a shelf. Because somebody got it and just kept it in a box, and that was it. But yeah, I mean, it's, it's a really nice car. These are <clears throat> 2005. They were still doing pretty good. So I guess I can't complain about those. But, uh, yeah. So there you go. There you have it. Number 31, Robbie Gordon's. Chevy Monte Carlo or, yep, Chevy Monte Carlo. I know it was Chevy, but I wasn't for sure if it was in, the, in Palo or Monte Carlo. But yep, <clears throat> there you have it. So, hope you guys liked the video. And uh, please like and subscribe. Hit that notification bell and give me a thumbs up. And leave a comment down below. And hope you guys enjoyed the video. And let me know if there's anything else you guys want to see. Maybe I might have it and I can show you. 
So we'll see you in the next video. Be safe out there. Thanks for watching. Bye.